type in del in the concept finder, the user can explore the concept spaces with different categories around del. For example, if we want to check the computer category, we can find a lot of queries related to del in computer, like del workstations, uh, del computer corp. If you want to go deeper in the hierarchy, you can go, for example, to check this cluster, and you can find additional information related or not related directly to Dell about Microsoft, Windows, software, computer. So you can find things like Dell computers again, or you can find things like Windows XP. If we check, for example, the business category, you can find things like Dell Financial or Dell Financial Services. In our first scenario, the user wants to find information about Dell computers. Maybe he wants to buy a new laptop or just check the prices. So in the ontology builder, he will type Dell. The builder will, will create the graph for him. So from this graph, we can get a lot of information about Dell. For example, we have that Dell means Dell Computer Corporation. It also means Dell Computers Online. Uh, those uh, bo both queries can be used to look for Dell on, on the internet. They both have uh, a website called Dell.com, and Dell also means Dell Canada, which in turn has website Dell.ca. Another interesting thing here is that maybe users don't know that Dell offers some financial services. So from here we see that Dell Financial means Dell Financial Services and it has this website where you can go check the services they offer. If the user types Cinco de Mayo in the concept finder, he can also explore the concept spaces around this query. For example, for Cinco de Mayo, we, we will get the categories computer, reference, society, home. So if we go to the home category, you can get things re uh, related to Cinco de Mayo like Cinco de Mayo desserts, Cinco de Mayo festivals, recipes, Mexican food for Cinco de Mayo, and so on. Going deeper in the hierarchy, you can get additional things related to recipes, food, cooking, for example, things like cream of chicken, a recipe for tender, so on. If we go to society, you can find queries related to the Cinco de Mayo history, or Cinco de Mayo in Mexico, or how Cinco de Mayo is celebrated. Going deeper in the hierarchy, you can find additional queries related to 1950s, or the Cold War, or presidents, like a Biography of Rosa, or 1950s TV, so on. The user can have some information like, uh, uh, if you want information about the holiday, the Mexican holiday Cinco de Mayo, you can get the data in this website, Mexo Online. Then, for example, if the user wants to know about drinks prepared in the, during this holiday, he can go to this website. Cinco de Mayo .info, which has data about the drinks. If the user looks for American Eagle in the concept finder, he can explore the concept spaces around American Eagle. So we have three categories around American Eagle. We have the business, so you can find things about American Eagle Credit Union or Amer American Eagle Federal. If you go to shopping, you can find like American Eagle clothing, American Eagle Outfitter. Going deeper in the hierarchy, you can find things related to shopping, clothing, fashion. If you go to recreation, you can find that information about American Eagle Airlines. Okay, finally, in our third scenario, the user wants to look for information about um, uh, American Eagle. Here he will get some info like uh, American Eagle 
also means American Eagle Outfitters. And American Eagle also means AE. And they all have the website AE.com. So you have three different ways to look for a, uh, American Eagle online. And American Eagle Outfitters, some kind of uh, Outfitters related thing.